I am glad to, to get this opportunity to speak on this motion tonight on such a huge issue in this country. So as of now, do we know, is the sale of turf banned or not in Ireland? As far as the Taoiseach was concerned today, he said it's okay this year. So it's kicked the can down the road as far as the Taoiseach is concerned. Of course, he'll be gone, so he don't care, um, as in from next year. Minister Ryan, you're here now, came out last week and said that grannies would not be arrested for burning turf. I wonder, do you dream... Uh, do you dream up this nonsense and turn it out of your mouth for the crack? This government actually have no idea what is happening on the ground. Your TDs are frantic and today they're saying they had a, a great robust uh, backbenchers meeting. They're all in deep trouble because they know it in their constituency and they'll get it hot and heavy. And they're on the ground and they're going around in a bubble just waiting for the next nod and wink grant aid announcement so they can lay claim to taxpayers' money and glorify. They got it when the groups tell me most are insulted as it's the groups themselves are working their butts off to put the grant places in, in place in the first place. We all saw the Taoiseach and his lack of interest this afternoon here in the Dáil, when we bought up what the struggling farmers, fishermen and ordinary mothers and fathers are going through, thanks to this government. All he gave is a smirky and sarcastic comment, which have no place here in the Dáil, when we have constituents coming to us asking us how are they going to pay the ever-rising costs of daily living, or if they should uh, pay for heating their homes or putting food on the table. The last couple of weeks have made this island a laughing stock, Minister uh, Ryan, announcing what you dreamt of overnight. And Fianna Fáil and, T uh, as I said, Fine Gael TDs jumped and up and down, frantic, trying to hide from behind this shameful announcement. But Fianna Fáil and Fine Gael TDs are completely guilty of what's going on during the Easter break. I heard uh, a so-called expert speaking on Radio 1 last uh, Saturday morning, stating that wet turf is dangerous. Where did RTE find this comedian? No one living in rural Ireland wet, burns wet turf, unless they're crazy. And the good people, the good people of, of rural Ireland will not do, would not ever do the like of it.